Hi guys, this is Breffy and welcome to the talk show again. Ever since the last talks I had on life, a few friends have requested me to talk about uh, a miserable life and life mysteries. But then uh, I had these weird ideas and I think uh, what if I combine them together with addiction because addiction brought a miserable life and life mysteries happens to those who overcomes your addiction right you know that so uh, let, let me ask you guys what addiction means to you there are many types of addictions but I am going to focus on drugs. So I'll tell you my ideas, how I see, how I see addiction. I heard, I have heard that addiction is a disease and it can be cured. And I hear say that once an addict is always an addict and and I said none of these two applies or worked on me because if you if, if, if you carefully listen to the two sayings they seem to have a contradiction think about it so my little ignorance knowledge tells me not to simply rely on someone else's definition on what addiction is or so whatever. So, because whatever situations it may be, the victim always knows better than the bystanders. It is a fact. And Many people ask these questions, is addiction a choice or not? Uh, the answers will be different, but if you ask me, I'll say, yes, it is a choice. No one forces you. 50-50, I got no one to blame. They introduce me and I have a free will and I chose it. So, yeah, it is a choice. So, being a willing victim, addiction is, I know best, true to the addiction as I know is true to the best of my knowledge is that it is a virus which cannot be totally cured mentally but can be stabilized both physically and mentally if it were a disease then I suppose some genius amongst ones in a million once in a million would have already found the ultimate cure of it and there would be a medicine, the cure in today's pharmacies. So using the word disease for explaining or defining addiction is too way simple for me. It is a free stage where everyone has the right to speak what's in their mind. So taking off my advantage of my rights, I will say that addiction should be obsession plus possession. I'll explain it. When a person is obsessed on something, the most powerful thought of yours will cling on that something and nothing and nothing would undo nor move your thoughts from that thing the only and the, the one and only single thing you want most will be definitely be that something and nothing else on be on its behalf on the other hand when a person is when the when a person is being possessed, it means that 
It means that the person is no longer in control of himself, but rather something external force is fully governing the person. And when the moment and the moment possession and obsession becomes one, the outcome and result is hazardous and bizarre. So a person when a substance becomes his first primary needs or priority or whatever, then then it means that the person is in the stage of obsession and when the substance took full control of him, regardless of his avoidance, he is in the stage of obsession, which leads to nothing else but addiction. Thus, I hereby concluded my definition of addiction as obsession plus addiction equals to no, no, sorry. Obsession plus possession equals to addiction. Originating from both internal and external. And if I were to give a name, I'd name it in external. So thank you guys. See you next time on this same channel. And next time we'll be talking about the, la the life mysteries. Thank you. Love you all. And don't forget to subscribe. God bless.